God, you are so sexy. Oh. Oh, yeah, you too. You want this? Oh, yeah. Mm. Ah. Mm. Oh. oh my god. Oh. Hey dude, hey, hey, hey. I'm gonna call the police. Like, oh yeah, sorry. These are expensive. Sorry, yeah, yeah. Out. Out. Sorry. Out. So glad that there's another one. Who's your favorite character in Detroit? You! Oh come on! Was there a moment in Detroit that resonated with you personally? Sometimes. What was the toughest choice you faced in Detroit? <laughs> Why can't I connect to the internet? I'm already on the internet. Oh well. You're so pretty. You know, in this kind of situation, I would see someone special, too. Alarm deactivated. Welcome home, Marcus. Still remembers me. Well, what's this? One new message. Well, what do you know? Leo actually survived. So Leo survived that head injury. Well, that's good. Who are you? How did you get in? I need to see Carl. Carl isn't seeing anyone. You need to leave. Please. And I love how he just doesn't do anything. I need to see him. He's very weak. I'm not sure he'll be able to talk to you. Marcus, I was hoping you'd come. I missed you so much, girl. You don't know how much I've missed you. What's wrong? So he's not as hateful as he of humans as... Not. I'm completely lost, Carl. The whole world's falling apart around me. I try to do the right thing. I look for answers. I... Instead, I just find more doubts and more uncertainty. World's ruled by fear, Marcus. Fear of others. Fear of the future. It's like me, too old. It's time for a damn. Uh, Carl, look, seriously, what the fuck? Well, what should I do? Carl, they're killing my people. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but tell me, what choice do they give? Being alive is making choices between love and hate, between holding out your hand or closing it as a fist. I don't have any easy answers, Marcus. 
You have to accept the world as it is. Or fight to change it. You're my son, Marcus. Our blood isn't the same color. But I know part of me is in you. When the world falls into darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. You're one of those men. Face the abyss, but don't let it consume you. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. I reckon she got her passports. Now that's where Connor is. Now I know you're wondering why I turned him into a deviant. The humans managed to locate Jericho. But I'll explain this after the game is done. You just need to trust me. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife tower? Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place. Be careful. Oh, Mr. Josh. If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Well, it's good to see him on our side.
Oh, just one more. They say they don't want to take any risks with the deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps for extermination. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. What's your system status? I'm okay. The bullet didn't hit any by component. No, don't come closer. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. The army built five different camps in the Detroit area. They're building more all across the country. They're preparing for a genocide. It's not genocide, it's deactivation. We'll have changed the world or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. I love you, Marcus. Yeah, I'm sorry Marcus does not love you. Again, you may think I'm a racist, but I don't like interracial relationships. And I do not want to start one. That's why I refused to kiss North earlier. Okay, okay, Marcus, get up, get up, come on. No love with her. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. Well, now, they hate if they us. want war, they'll get it. Time for World War III. We are going to fight for our freedom, and we will succeed or die. Are you ready to follow me? Oh, Jericho likes me anyway. Okay, time for this World War III to begin.